Hey y'all, I've got some arugula here in front of me. I actually have two different types of arugula or ways to buy arugula. This is the more mature arugula that you find in bunches here. You can see these leaves. Uh, this is baby arugula that you're gonna find in containers. Not for nothing, I oftentimes buy it like this, pretty much just because it's a little bit, a slight little edge of convenience for me, but it will be usually a little bit more expensive to buy it in this container. Uh, it's up to you how you wanna do it. But if you do buy it in the container, it's gonna be baby arugula, so you see it's gonna look a little bit different. The leaves are still, you know, gonna be roughly the same shape, but much, much smaller. So nine times out of 10, when you see me cooking with arugula, it's gonna be this baby arugula, just because again, it just makes life so much easier to be able to grab a handful of arugula. But if you don't do that, that's cool too. You can totally prep your regular arugula uh, for use quickly during a recipe. What I would say to do, and what I like to do when I do buy arugula like this, is I actually keep it bound up. It's nice and easy if I do. Then I sort of make it even of a tighter piece, and then I just sort of cut it, or I can take my hands and just rip it. Not that difficult. And then there is arugula in pieces, and like literally five seconds and you're done. That's it for today.